And one of those things that uh, really hurt Mitt Romney in his presidential campaign was his 47% comment. Uh, as you might recall, Mitt Romney at a uh, private event said to his, uh, the people attending this event, he said that 47% uh, of this country will vote for Obama because they believe they are entitled to what the government gives them. Um, they're takers. They're takers. And they won't take responsibility for their own lives. The only thing they won't take is responsibility. That's basically what he said. And this video came out, and people, since people have wanted to know, where did this video come from? Who shot this video? Well, apparently the anonymous, the anonymous man who uh, recorded this video is going to come out tonight on, uh, I believe, MSNBC, and uh, unveil who he is. But he's been leaking out some information. Sources, like Huffington Post here, have been leaking out some information about him. And uh, basically, the man, uh, he uh, bartended for a company that uh, catered to high-end clientele. And uh, he previously worked at uh, different fun fundraisers, including one where uh, Bill Clinton spoke. And it turns out Bill Clinton had a lot to do with this video just becoming what it is and it's because bill clinton being the type of guy he is after addressing the guests the former president came back to the kitchen and thanked the kitchen staff the waiters the bartenders the busboys and everybody else involved in putting the event together he took the time to shake hands take photos he signed autographs and praised them for the wonderful job in making the meal happen now, when the, pro when, this, uh, when the bartender found out that he would be working a Romney fundraiser, he thought, oh, you know, Bill Clinton did this. Maybe uh, this is something that these He thought it was do. normal political this is maybe, behavior. Maybe all politicians are this nice to everybody up, up the chain. Up and down the chain, I should say. Uh, so when he found out he was working the Romney fundraiser, he decided to bring his camera so he'd be prepared to take a photo with the Republican presidential hopeful. Romney, of course, being Mitt Romney, did not speak to any of the staff working the event. He did not speak to the bussers, the waiters, any of the kitchen staff. What he did do is Mitt Romney did show up late to the event and rushed right out the door after speaking to the, uh, to the, to the people who he was, his rich buddies who were there to donate to money. The people, to the people donating money. Yes, he, addre he addressed the fundraiser and... Well, I mean, you can't fault him for addressing a fundraiser. Well, of course. <laughs> <laughs> but the point was was that, yes, there's no uh, – yes. Mitt Romney was basically like, uh, you know, middle class, poor people totally suck. Thanks for the money. Good night. So yeah. well, Mitt Romney uh, – the, yeah. the, the, the source, the, this, the guy who recorded the video did say that Mitt Romney told – he later found out that Mitt Romney did tell the dinner guest staffs that his comments were all off the record, which is ridiculous in itself to – to think you have anything off the record, you could say anything off the record when you're running, when you're the Republican presidential candidate. No, you, that could be off the record, but it's, it wasn't uh, specified. Still. There wasn't things he signed. He did not specify, though, to anybody else working. He there. didn't specify to anybody else working. So he didn't even take basic precautions to not make an ass of himself. Well, the bartender never planned on distributing the video. Um, but after Romney spoke, he felt like he had no choice. He was worried about losing his job and possibly not not being able to work at any of these events. But at the end, he said, I felt it was a civic duty. I couldn't sleep after I watched it. I felt like I had a duty to expose it. So, I mean, and, and he says that the Bill Clinton event had very much to do with the video happening. And I just find it hilarious that Bill Clinton inspired the video that ended up going to Jimmy Carter's grandson, <laughs> and Jimmy Carter's grandson released the video to Mother Jones, who ended up getting all this press for the video, and it ended up beating Mitt. It ended up helping being super influential and important in helping beat Mitt Romney and elect Barack Obama to his second presidential term. So basically, Mitt Romney, every single living presidential Democratic president just owned you. Yeah. Basically, it was like a super team. It was almost like a comic book where, like, Bill Clinton, <laughs> it was sort of They like, put their fists together they and, put like, their fists together and, and Captain energy. Planet showed up. Bill Clinton was like, all right, first I'm going to go to a fundraiser <laughs> and I'll be really nice. And then Mitt Romney will look like a total asshole. <laughs>